hey guys so i have something interesting too oh my gosh did you hear that open i lost my whole voice throughout that whole thing okay i got this from either i don't know where i got it from either got this from walmart or a supermarket i think it's from walmart but this is called brie president and it is soft ripened cheese and it was the most expensive one of the brie cheeses now i haven't had brie in so long i think i haven't had brie since i was quite young and i am looking so forward to trying with this with y'all guys i had to look up how to eat it now I, last time i ate it like real full brie cheese i think i was at i was a little kid and i remember we didn't like the rind but I looked up that people say that you can actually eat the rind and if you don't it's considered gauche and I was like what does the word gauche mean and gauche means unsophisticated and lowbrow if you do not eat the rind of the cheese so I said okay I'll try it I'm an adult now and I have sophistications so let's try it so this one opened up pretty good it was already like that I had no seal it was just like you know so I'm like okay um let's open it up fully it says best oh it's got best used oh what's coming up best used by december 30th 2020 wow that's that's actually a lot faster than i thought it would be i really thought i had a lot more time with this guy but i'm opening it now wow okay i did not expect it to um to be ready to go back so soon i thought i thought cheese lasted a lot longer than that i guess because it's brie it has to be eaten down so it says cheese board tips remove your brie from the refrigerator and allow it to warm up at room temperature for about 30 45 minutes we're not doing that and the flavor the flavor and aroma will fully emerge and your brie will be even creamier uh wine and beer pairing enjoy a brie with champagne um or lots we're not doing that either we're going to enjoy with some i got some juice and uh entertaining tips use brie as a quick appetizer to or indulge recipes like brie and crow pair of uh, apricots apples berries pears pine nuts and pistachios we have crackers so <laughs> that's what we're going to do all right let's see how you freaking open this guy he's like totally sealed wow that's sealed really tight Oh, that smells super strong. Wow. I can't tell if this is the rind or this is the paper. All right, so I did let it sit for a little bit, but not the half an hour. And it did feel soft. So Brie gets soft fast. Wow. I truly can't tell if this is... Like the rind or you can't even see it wow you cannot even see it i cannot tell if this is the rind or if it's covered in another type of paper it feels like paper the rind feels so much like paper look at this guys it feels like cheesecloth it's so much fun having my own breed to myself though that is that is so fun that smells like goat cheese actually which is interesting i actually love goat cheese all right so let's try it it's not me of that borgonzola that i made a review one many years ago so i'm trying to make sure i can see it but it is just nothing but whiteness uh and it's a little stiff so i know it probably tastes better if i let it warmed up but we're not i don't feel like doing all that we're just going to try it as is, guys. We're going to try it as is. Now, a lot of people remove the rind, but I'm not. I'm not afraid of the rind. So, let's try it. I thought you were supposed to remove the rind, too. Really, I did. And we did when I was a youngster. But now, I know you're not supposed to. So, let's try it. It smells strong. Mmm. <laughs> That tastes good though. Mmm. I like a strong cheese. That's good. Okay, this is the weird part, guys. It tastes like seafood. Yeah, I would recommend definitely eat the rind. That's good. Alright, so it tastes like seafood. 
this tastes almost like shellfish it's got a really creamy the inside is just cream it is so creamy so lovely it's a creamy inside the rind as a nice i'm glad you are missing out if you only eat the inside you're missing out on brie the the inside is soft as butter it's not even like you know how you get um cream cheese it's softer the inside is soft as butter and the outside is not that hard or strange i'm gonna oh i'm using my favorite honey this is my favorite jamie's i told y'all about it they had to take it off the shelf when the pandemic happened they no longer sold it but they had it back and i was like yes jamie's is back love jamie's honey is really good so let's put some little honey on here i don't want it to spill all over me so i want y'all see it but i want to put over the uh plate oh yeah okay guys there's some honey on my brie let's try it mm. Mm. that's fun Mm. Mm hmm. The honey adds that little bit of um sweet that is not bad. I was missing out. The rind really adds to it. That is so good. It, uh, tell me, guys, if y'all have eaten brie before, brie cheese, is it just me or does it taste like seafood? Because it does. For me, it tastes like shrimp. Weird, right? A little oceany. That's good. All right, so we got the cracker, Ritz, brie. And I mean, everything tastes better on the Ritz, right? And let's put it right here. And some honey. I can see it. Oh, now that's an hors d'oeuvre right there, guys. That's an hors d'oeuvre. Y'all can see it's a little bit. Ah, uh, brie, honey, and a Ritz. Oh, I cannot wait to try it. Let us try it. I feel so fancy. Man, I wish I had my fancy glass. I would eat, I would eat off of that. <laughs> Mm. Mm. Rich tastes good with it. Rich adds a little breadish taste to it. Very nice. Mmm. that felt like class it was very good um love it i would highly recommend brie if you like your cheese strong like you'll like it it does not taste like cheddar it does not taste like any type of cheese it has its own distinct flavor the inside is very mild the outside has the shrimp type of taste to me and um yeah, it's not cheddar, it's not mozzarella, it's not uh, gouda, it's not monster, it's not any of those. It's not even goat cheese. It's, out, it's closer to goat than it is the other ones I just mentioned, but goat has its own distinct flavor too. And this guy, the inside is super mild, the outside is a, is a beautiful... Um, seafoody taste uh i'm not gonna repeat myself but i kind of am just surprised at that seafood taste it's like really shocking the freak out of me i don't remember it before but granted i did scoop out the i scooped the inside out of it before i never had the rind because I mean, nobody knew we didn't know i mean, back in my day before remember i'm born in 89 so when last time i ate brie like this I think it was 98 or 97. There was no internet. The internet did not exist. Not like this in 97. So we thought we had to peel off the the, the brie. We thought, to, we, had, we thought we couldn't eat the rind. That's delicious. So yeah, this is 10 out of 10. We'll recommend it. 
it was delicious so tell me in the comments if y'all tried brie before do you like brie and which be willing to try it again okay guys and what would you pair it with i would probably pair it with just the way i had it it's good i don't want to overpower with, like fruit but maybe grapes maybe but um overall it doesn't need it the, the, the fruit part you can take from your juice or whatever you're drinking with it so that was delicious okay guys bye <laughs>